Burton Fire Station Fundraising Committee, uh, which I'm chair. We do a lot of fundraising in the uh, local area for large recognised charities such as the Firefighters Charity, but also for local charities in the area such as Fountains uh, Special School. Um, so we do do uh, a lot of this fundraising um, outside of our own work time. Um, which we find rewarding and it's also a good motivational tool for uh, staff and uh, it's, it's very good for the local community, they benefit from it also. Um, we've done lots of different types of events one of the things that we did was a uh, Everest charity ladder climb um, which involved a Red Watch and the Burton F uh, Fire Station Fundraising Committee and uh, members of other shifts as well uh, which were there to climb the height of Everest um, as a relay over a period of time. Now we did it on, we did it in August. And it was very warm, very very hot, but we managed to do it within the allocated time that we'd uh, allowed for ourselves, and uh, raise some significant funds for it. So we're quite pleased. The grab bag appeal, and uh, one of my colleagues um, actually initiated this, um, Jason Gardner, and um, we've actually donated a thousand pounds to their uh, grab bag appeal. Now. Probably a lot of you are thinking what a grab bag appeal is, um, but basically it's a um, it's a piece of first aid equipment. It's a, a trauma bag that's located in the grounds of uh, Queen's Hospital. Um, inside that bag, we have resuscitation equipment and um, an ultrasound uh, piece of equipment, uh, which um, will be really really useful for anyone who's suffered any any trauma, and uh, they can identify exactly where the, the problem areas are. Uh, and also, uh, as part of that, there is a defibrillator as well. So all this costs a lot of money. I think it was up to £10,000 worth of money. Um, and they had £1,000 to raise, um, which hardly signs with it, with the main sort of uh, sponsors behind it. And we wanted to help them out, so we uh, we came along and uh, just made the last little bit up, which was uh, £1,000. So, again, we're very pleased to uh, donate that money to them. I'm not really sure who's nominated me, to be honest with you. I I think it may be uh, somebody from our area command, um, which again I really appreciate, uh, and it just raises the profile uh, of our fundraising committee and uh, helps us to um, again use it as a bit of a mo uh, motivational tool to r to raise even more money. Um, and like I say, it's nice to focus on something positive. Um, we're in very difficult times at the moment, and I think uh, it's it's good to have something to be able to um, to focus on, which is really positive. Um, I'm really pleased to be nominated um, and I really want to sort of dedicate the award as well to the fundraising committee uh, and the shifts that have helped me to raise, appreciate that, um, but I haven't done it on my own, I have done it with other members of, uh, of, of the Burton Fire Station which, uh, which I'm really grateful. Um, we've got some interesting things uh, coming up. Uh, one of the things we're looking at is a charity ab sale. Um, we, we have got a, uh, a charity ab sale uh, at headquarters. Uh, which is coming up very soon, part of the Firefighters Charity, but we're also looking to do uh, another one, which uh, hopefully will be this year, but could be next year, uh, which is local to Burton-on-Trent. Uh, we're just uh, looking into it at the moment, and uh, we've also hopefully uh, going to organise a, a charity uh, open day um, for the for Burton Fire Station, and this will possibly be the last time we'll be able to do that with this current station, as we're hopefully going to uh, have a new station in the future. Um, you can contact myself or uh, another member of the uh, fundraising committee, but um, uh, myself, my number is 01785 898 942. And uh, if, if you've got some good ideas for fundraising or you, you feel that you're a charity that, uh, that would like to benefit from some of the money that we raise, that's, that's fine, absolutely fine to get in contact with me. Um, we are looking to make uh, further donations throughout the year. Um, we're looking that each shift has got an allocation at the moment of £800, which they are looking to uh, donate to local charities.